All right, let's just get pepper. I know people say you shouldn't pepper. I'm going to show you something. You know, soccer players that do this. You know, I could do lots of these because I played soccer. Yeah, but have you ever seen a soccer player do that in the game? No. Yet every professional soccer player can dribble hundreds of times, thousands of times. Because what? They control the ball. So pepper, you control the ball, you know? So let's pepper, 10 foot line, end line. Let's get a pepper partner, just two. You and a partner, not three people. Let's get some other groups out there. So we have six people, end line and three meter line. End line, three meter line, just pepper. All right. Overhand only, so you're digging the ball overhand. Regular pepper, but dig the ball overhand. Very good. Now, dig to yourself, set to yourself, hit at your partner. Dig to yourself, set to yourself. Good movement drill. Good ball control drill. Okay, same drill, now go across the net. So your tit, three meter line to three meter line. Okay, same drill, go, dig, set, hit. Dig, set, hit with a jump at the end. These young ladies have very good ball control. All right, pair up into doubles quickly. Pair up into doubles and you're just going to be two of you half court on that side, two of you half court this side, two half court that side, two half court this side. So two on each side. So what we're doing is just a little pepper over the net. So you're hitting the ball. You're going to what? You're going to dig a ball to a setter. She's going to set you. Then you're going to rotate, right? Got it? You've done this drill, I know, right? Go. So small sided games and you're going to rotate each time. Now we need a little ball control. So let's stay on the ground first. Don't jump for a while. Stay on the ground. Go ahead. <laughs> 